Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Aaron, and today I want to talk about this event that, that I'm showing you on screen right now, Dungeon Delver's Delights. For a limited time, epic dungeon trial and skirmish chests are twice as likely to drop premium items. Okay, so this is only going to be a quick video, but why is this an event? This should be the fundamentals of a D&D &D game. You should be rewarded for running dungeons. You should be rewarded running trials and running skirmishes. Why do you have to wait for an event just to be encouraged to run the content inside the game? It makes no sense. This event needs to be deleted and it needs to be in the general coding of the game. You need to make dungeons profitable. You need to make trials profitable. You need to make skirmishes profitable. You have scaled everyone down to these dungeons, the, the levels of these dungeons. As soon as we go in, you know, we don't get to see our power. We can only see our true power in Voss because we're not actually scaled. We've worked so hard to get to endgame. Why can't we, why can't it be how it used to be? Scaling hasn't helped anyone. You are scaling the lower players up if they're under level, which isn't right. They have to get to the right level in order to run a dungeon. That's the only fair way of doing it. And you're scaling the endgame players who have tried so hard to get to endgame. They've invested, they've spent, but the only way they can see their true numbers is either running the campaigns or running Voss. Does that seem right to you, Cryptic? This event needs to be scrapped. This event needs to be in the general coding of the game. This is why low level players are leaving. Because it's so hard for them just to get anywhere in the game. You have to help people out. Stop scaling people down, stop scaling people up, and make running content profitable again. Because making AD is so hard, making Zen is so hard, I understand it's a business. I understand that. But if people like a game, they will spend money on it. You are going about this entirely wrong. You're supposed to listen to the community. If they're enjoying the game, they will then spend money on that game. You don't even play your game. If you played your game, you will know what was wrong with it. And the fact that people are scaled down in dungeons is something that is wrong. I've spent years getting my character up to endgame, but I can only see my true damage in something like Voss. Yeah, sure, the other dungeons might be easier, but it's not about that. I want to see my power in these dungeons. I don't want to be one shot in MSPC by, I don't know what the mobs are even called, by Cyclops alien guy. You've made every character so squishy with this new combat system, people are leaving now. You've made Voss so hard. And yes, I have completed it many, many times. But my character's so squishy in there, it doesn't matter. The first boss to avoid all the poison, the poison can kill me in two ticks. I've got 45% uh, percent defense and awareness, I believe. And they're both on 42k. I shouldn't be dying like that. I'm on nearly... I think I'm on about 650,000 hit points. I don't want the combat system to change again. That's expensive. But stop the scaling. Stop this event. It should be in the general coding. 
you should be encouraging people to run dungeons. That will help your player retention. Because right now you're not helping anyone. You're not helping the new players. You're not helping the old players. You're not helping the end game players. You're not even helping yourselves. Because no one's spending money on the game. In fact, you're bringing out packs. For how much were the triple mount packs? What, 9800 zen? So let's say 10,000 zen. And 5,000 zen is about 3.7 million. So let's say the 10,000 zen pack is about 7.5 million. Let me show you. Is it still here? Here. So, you get the free legendary mounts, you get 9 insignias and a vanity pet. That's all for 7.5 million. How much is that pack alone on the auction house? So, for the whole thing on Zen, it's 7.5 million. It's 11 million just for the pack on the auction house. This is why it's so impossible for smaller players to grow. Because your whole market is so messed up. And the way of fixing that is to bind everything that is bought on the Zen market. So people buy what they need and make everything droppable in dungeons. That is all you need to do. It's not hard. Magic, Magic the Gathering is ended. So put your time and your resources into knowing your own community. That's how this game succeeds. But anyway guys, I'm out of time. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe. Try get this to Cryptic, because they need to hear this. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.